What's good everybody, welcome back to the channel and today I'm gonna make a beat without using mm -hmm. FL Studio. Yeah, I asked you guys if you think I could make a fire beat not using FL. Some people have faith in me, but damn, some people didn't. <laughs> I mean, look at these results. Today's actually a sponsor video. I'm gonna be using Serato Studio and I'm gonna cook up a beat using a track lib sample. Shout out to the good folks at Serato for lacing me. So let's find a sample. sounds super fire i think i might start with that one it's like super simple and i know i can like do something bouncy with it so this is what serato studio looks like now as you can tell this is way different from fl this is like foreign to me like i'm in unknown territory you know like gta or fortnite when they have like the question mark on the map like i didn't unlock that shit yet <laughs> so this is like where you chop the samples this is where you like add the drums the instruments and you get your sound so it's like completely flipped but I'm figure this out though so i chopped it up i didn't chop it up crazy some open heads. That's not right. Right there. There. Right there. <laughs> I need some more like percussion. Oh. Uh uh. Like that's where the eight away go. It's on a fire. I oh, don't know. Let me find a kick or something. Say this kick. Gotta keep it simple the second time around. put an effect on the sample Let's see it affects let me see if i could put like a chorus on there that shit would sound pretty cool there's a ton of sounds already in here and stuff but i don't know i might have to throw that in there let's see let's see how it sounds and then tuck it real low oh shit okay 
gotta find the right 808. All right, so let's add an 808 because this shit is sounding pretty fire to me. So this is a uh, this is the bass notes. I think I'm not so sure, but hopefully. <laughs> There you go, that's the 808 pattern right there. All right, I'm gonna just do a quick structure and then close this beat out. All right, so I'm finished. <laughs> I'm not gonna add no more nothing. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little bit of a learning curve, but I think it came off fire and I think I beat the challenge. I just did a quick little arrangement they use like a block system, so it's like different scenes and patterns and stuff. It's kind of new to see how other people make music, but I think this is sounding fire though. It's not bad for a first time though. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And if you guys want this free software, there's a link down below in the description and you can just sign up for it and try it out. It's a little bit of a learning curve, I'm not gonna lie, but I think if you wanna get your ideas out as quick as possible, definitely worth a try let me know down in the comments too if you guys want some more serato studio challenges because this was definitely fun that's all what this is about having fun big thank you to serato for sponsoring this video and yeah i can't wait to do another one so with that being said i will catch you guys next time